Hi, this is Amy from Slimful Treats. It's going to be summertime and a lot of people are going to have some barbecues. And this is actually also a two-part video. At first, I'm going to show you my roasted sweet potatoes. I've had a lot of people going, oh, I hate sweet potatoes. Get your mind out of the fix that it has to be marshmallows and cinnamon and sugar. Sweet potatoes are a lot more diverse than that. And you can actually incorporate a lot of flavors that you would never think. Do savory do chili powder, do any type of ingredients that you think might taste good with a sweet, but yet have that spicy edge to it. Now, I have a bowl here of pre-diced sweet potatoes. I peel them, I wash them, I slice them, and I just cut them up into cubes. You want the cubes to be rather even. Spread these out and put them on your tray. Now, we are going to have to use a little bit of oil. You're going to want to use a good grade oil, olive oil, avocado oil, or grapeseed oil. It does not matter which, it's all personal preference. Right now I am using some grapeseed oil. Put them on your potatoes. And I make my own savory spice mix. It has a blend of many spices that you would not probably think would go on a sweet potato. I do have my spice list listed for people after they subscribe on request through my um, through my web page which is slimfultreats at gmail.com now I just sprinkle that on top and we mix all of these together yes your hands are going to get very messy and I washed my hands before you're going to want to wash them after be very careful not to rub your eyes especially if you're using any of the hotter spices and just mix that in really well. That's all there is to it. Mix it, mix it. I'm making quite a large batch just because I am having a get together today. And a lot of people who are not needing to lose weight, but they like the healthier sweet potato salad, I have to make a lot more because they will eat this up before they will eat up the regular potato salad. I've learned that from experience when I used to bring over my little pre-prepared trays because I didn't think anybody would eat it. All you do is you pop it into a preheated oven, 425 degrees, and you roast. I will see you again after. It usually takes about 25 minutes to roast. I want you to check it in 15 minutes and check for doneness. You also are going to take it out at 15 minutes. Just stir those sweet potatoes again, and I'll see you later. And now we're going to check the potatoes. Just take them out. Them out. Okay. And they're already starting to smell wonderful. You can just smell all those nice spices. Just kind of stir them up a little bit. And yeah, please excuse the laughter of children in the background. It happens to be a Sunday afternoon here. And we've got a couple of young boys in the next room. Usually I wouldn't have that, but it's family day. And yeah, they're not quite done yet. You still feel a little resistance. So I'm going to pop them right back in the oven. And you don't want to make these things too mushy. You just want to have them just done so that they hold together for a potato salad later. And I'll see you again in about another 10, 15 minutes. Okay, time to check for those potatoes again. Oh yeah, they look about done. Let's just take them out. We'll test them. And they are done. Now, I a lot of times will serve these for supper, just as they are. My husband, everybody who tries these loves these. But I need to tell you, stay tuned for the second part of this video. Right now, this is roasted sweet potatoes. Could be used for anything for supper. Second part of this video, it is going to be turned into roasted sweet potato salad, which is a wonderful alternative for your fattier traditional potato salads. So, I'll be back filming in the second part of this video in about an hour. Thank you, and I'd like to say, please, subscribe, like, and share. And I want to also have a shout out for Amy McKinstry and all of her people. Thank you all very, very much for all of your support.